Cheers all. And if you liked that one, you're probably not going to like the rest of it. Because <laughs> it, it doesn't follow in the same vein, really. Um, does anybody want to tell me what the three uh, following characters have in common? Porky Pig, Winnie the Pooh, and Paddington Bear. They don't wear trousers. Excellent. None of them wear trousers. And in a similar theme, um, this is a poem about working from home. <laughs> I'm glad I didn't have to lead you there too, too, too much. Okay, so it's called Homework. Zoom it up, mate. Office is passe. Hate your commute, give it the boot. Stay at home to do your job. No one will know that you're a slob, because colleagues only see your top half. They won't know that you're bare arsed and sitting there in food stained joggers with gruffalo slippers on your trotters. Blur the background in all meetings. Rehearse your repertoire of greetings. Can you hear me? What about now? You've turned your microphone off somehow. You can analyse that data and maybe have a shower later. Don't subscribe to Workplace Dogma. Work in your pyjamas if you want to. Wear stylish headgear in an online chat. A fascinator or a hat. A bowler, beret or fedora. But keep that gimp mask in the drawer. <laughs> Accountants. You can balance ledgers almost in the altogether. IT people, do system reboots virtually in your birthday suits. One top tip that bears repeating is don't drink booze during a meeting, unless disguised in some receptacle, but not that room mug that's unacceptable. Conduct an important interview while you're sitting on the loo. The candidate won't know at all that you're dropping kids off at the pool. <laughs> Produce some figures, charts and tables in the midst of laying cable. Turn off your camera to pick your nose. Fart on you. Who's going 